Hello, hello everyone. Hi, welcome. Welcome to Uzbekistan. My name is Azamat, uh, and you are welcome to our pavilion, please. So this is a big, big entrance with the big displays. As you can see, uh, there are three minarets. It means uh, three main cities on Silk Road. It's Samarkand, Bukhara and Hiva. As you can see, we have a beautiful facade and uh, welcoming to our visitors. And we can proceed inside. So it's a busy ex exhibition? Uh, yes, it was today a really busy day, like always the Fridays, but nowadays in five minutes we're closing. Uh, as you can see, here is our main entrance. On the right hand, you have our bazaar, all uh, our Sunnis from Uzbekistan, which is uh, handmade. It's here, please, yeah. And we can proceed on the exhibition first floor, please. about this is our tradition <coughs> handicraft it's, it's a, it's a ganj it's all handmade but here is a it's a for quran i mean it's from the old times you put quran here and all, all uh, the people <coughs> used it in madrasa in an islamic school all right please So we see like uh, uh, you, star constellations. You constellations. See our, yeah. Uh, first floor exhibition. Here you can see our welcoming to Uzbekistan. Our sign with our uh, symbol of the Phoenix bird. Uh, here is our history part. We start with some history. Here you can see our uh, famous Islamic scientist, which lived on the Golden Age. Yeah. Uh, here is uh, Al Biruni. He was a famous anthropologist in the world. Here is uh, Al Kashgari. It's a medieval ling linguist in the world, the first linguist in the world. Uh, Al Harazmi is a father of algebra. He founded the zero place. Yeah, and of course uh, the famous Ibn Sina, the Avicenna is called in Europe. He uh, uh, famous in the Europe like uh, Avicenna. He's a father of medicine. Excuse me, guys. And here is uh, our a famous uh, astronomer, Mizza Ulubek, and of, of course, Imam al Bukhari. He wrote the uh, hadith about uh, our Prophet and is very famous in uh, Islamic culture. Here we go, please. Here is the part of the history, as I told you. As, uh, as you can see in the beginning, uh, I explained you, explain you about uh, our vision. Well, our concept that we built uh, our pavilion it's a Samarkand, Buhara and Hiva the ancient cities in the world uh, Samarkand is uh, 2700 years old and it's uh, under UNESCO wow. okay now I will proceed this big display as this big display shows our culture shows our culture our ancient cities as you can see uh, yeah, it's like intro about Uzbekistan. Right. Here we go. Now we're proceeding to uh, present days of Uzbekistan. Uh, the 30 years of success. We have independence like from 1991. And as you can see the road, air, rail. We succeed uh, in all part of machinery, industry. As you can see, we have a leather production, we have a machinery production. Uh, of course, the cotton industry, we are exporting a lot of cotton in the world. Uh, yeah, some, it's a TVs and electronics. Manufacturing? Manufacturing, yeah, it's all manufactured in Uzbekistan. Um, and of course, agriculture. We have, we have a four seasons. What's we happened with the gas? Oh, uh, we have a, lo a lot of uh, gas. And it's one of the biggest uh, uh, gas reserves in the world. Yeah, we have a gas reserve, we have uh, oil reserves, we have uh, copper, gold and silver reserves. Yeah, to Uzbekistan. Here we go, please. Yeah. 
here is showing our four seasons. We have four seasons uh, in a year. In winter it's cold, minus yeah. 10. Uh, and the summer is plus 45. And it's not so uh, wet, it's dry weather. Look what I found, what did he find? Here is the cartoon for the kids. It shows all our, uh, about our history. About is it the food? Yes, please. It's our national cuisine. It's a pilaf. We call it plof. Monty, Hanu, Somsa. And it's really tasty. And you are welcome to country to taste it. Yeah. Here we go. We will proceed to our beautiful... Uh, wait, 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 wait. Beautiful room. Well, the photo zone. Yes, please. Cool. It shows like uh, it's our concept to do this. It's a uh, freedom. It's uh, our culture with Islam, and uh, that can people can take the photos and relax here. There's a fresh air. Yes, please. Uh, and the traditional lamps or uh, yes, yes. It's well known like uh, it's from uh, old old times. These lamps, yeah. All right. Nice. Thank you. We can press Special it. room. Who, who designed this? Uh, Who's the designer? Who's of that? course, our designers. Yeah. From uh, from Uzbekistan. Yes. All the pavilion was designed. Architects. Yeah. Yeah. Architect by All right. by our uh, designers from Uzbekistan. All right. Here we go. Yeah. We can proceed to other room. Okay. Excuse me. Here we. Here is a photo zone. You can see. Yeah. Uh, it's a uh, main entrance of uh, Masjid. Masjid, it's uh, Masjid and Madrasa. We have the same entrance, and people can take the photos here as well. Okay. The next room is it's our future. Sustainability. That we are in sustainability, as you can see. Our vision in the future. How will teach in the schools? Let's go to the education. Future of education. What's the What's the thinking here? Uh, the future of education that we're showing, yeah, our automatic education about uh, machinery, of course, uh, kind of manufacture, about uh, the agriculture, how we, uh, how we see it in the future. How many people in Uzbekistan? Uh, in Uzbekistan, living 37 million people. That's big population, right? Yes, please. Yes, it's really yeah. big, big population. Yeah. And. Um, uh, are you inviting a lot of people from around the world to come and get an education in Uzbekistan? Of course, we are open for everybody nowadays. In three years ago, we opened the borders more than 100 countries. And you're welcome to study, to make a business, to invest in the country. And of course, and also the visit, yeah, the tourists. We had like, uh, before COVID, we have five, six million uh, tourists in our country. And there's a good flight connections? Of course, the flight connection with whole world. All right, and uh, one, one million Uzbek coders, you have a lot of software development? Yes, of course, with? yeah. Nowadays, the IT, uh, <coughs> you know, it's like everywhere in the world, IT is really developing in our country as well. This is like our sustainable future. Everybody speaks English? All the 37 million? No, not no? all, not all, please. How yeah. many? Uh, actually, I don't All know the young the people? I don't know, the, yeah, young people, yes, of course. Yeah. The old generation, not. Here is uh, the center of Uzbekistan, uh, Tashkent, our capital. It's a Tashkent city. It was built uh, two years ago. So you have a, a fountain light show fountain with a building in the back. It's a building, and here nearby, it's a it's building a new. It's it's coming new building. Big uh, like a name, Burj Khalifa. The one, uh, no, 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 no. The next one, the name is will be like fifty. 50 floors. It's uh, one right. of the tallest uh, building in Central Asia. All right. And uh, every night, every half hour, does a show? Yes, please. Every half hour, yeah, it's coming show in the night time. All right. Popular place to go, right? I'm sorry? Everybody wants to go and yes, look Yes, of course. It. Yeah, yeah. Everybody wants to go there and to see the show. And it's the park as well. You can drink coffee, drink tea, walk around. So you're doing a okay. wind farm solution. solution, this is what the screen is about? Yes, with a cooperation with Mazdar companies, UA company. It's our vision for the future as well, as how, you can see. 
How much renewables do you have right now? How much more are you building renewable energy? Oh, nowadays, I, I, I don't know really, I can't count because it's too much, it's coming, yeah, it's boom with the construction in our country. And here is a market you can see. Here is a center of Islamic civilization. Uh, it's uh, one of the biggest buildings in Central Asia, 100 meters tall. Yeah, inside will be like masjid, it's a <coughs> mosque, madrasa, school of Islam, and museum. And uh, everybody's welcome. Everybody's welcome, exactly. Uh, it's our, it's not uh, finished yet. It will finish in one year. It's under construction wow. now. That's very big, 100 yes. meters tall, all the walls. Exactly, yeah, yeah. It's uh, one of the biggest uh, buildings in the Central Asia. All right. Uh, here you can see, <coughs> here is the mining. Here is the mining of the copper, gold and silver. It's located uh, in Al-Malik, it's Al-Malik city in Uzbekistan. Here is the four kilometers, two kilometers and one kilometer deep. They oh. mining copper, gold and silver, yeah. It's found the, this place in 1948 and it still works from the 1948. This is, yeah. it was, yes, our last uh, rooms, a room. I mean, and this we can. Is, uh, the, uh, we the, can after proceed. closing time, there. Yes, and it's also the ten ten. I mean, we yeah. need to close now. Yeah. Uh, what I can say, thank you for attention, and uh, welcome to Uzbekistan. We are open for everybody.